Hi folks, I'm Mike from Minnesota. Welcome to my channel. Well, today is uh, January 12, 2022, and uh, it's my first trip out onto the ice, and I'm uh, going out with a friend of mine, Bruce. You'll see him later in this video, hopefully pulling up some fish. And uh, our first stop today is uh, Fred's Bait and Deer River. Uh, Fred's has been here for a long time, and it has uh, been the go-to place for people getting bait coming up to uh, the Winnie Cutfoot uh, Beach Lake chain. Um, so today uh, we're gonna be going out on Lake Winnie and uh, thanks to a friend of mine, uh, Jake, friends Jake and Amy Parrington will be going out to their fish shack and uh, using their ice castle today. So today let's go in and uh, see what kind of bait we're gonna pick up to uh, to bring out. Uh, Amy is already out at the uh, ice castle, opening it up, drilling the holes, turning the heat on, and Bruce and I will uh, stop uh, at the resort. We're gonna go out of the pines. We're gonna stop at the resort, uh, pay for the ice road pass, and then uh, head out there. So let's go pick some. What do we put it in here? Yep. What do you suggest, Bill? We're going out to Winnie. Probably some of that river mix. It's got trainers and rainbows and bats. And okay. Seems like you have to get some stuff for your set lines and stuff for jigging. And I want to get some uh, some crappie minnows too. Okay. Half a pint, about four dozen. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. You want a couple bucks in crappie? Yeah. And then I want uh, a few uh, big, bigger ones for Northern. How big? Uh, Amy said large shiners. Oh, how many of them you want? All right. I got them in the back. A few. Six? Yeah, aren't these? But you put you for suckers. She said shiners, so. though. Shut your door. Thank you. Hi. Hi folks, well, we're at our destination here on uh, Lake Winnebagosh and our accommodations today are provided by Jake and Amy Carrington, the owners of Cutfoot Sioux Resort. Uh, they opened up a little area out here on the lake that uh, they wanted to try and they have some friends uh, next to them over here and uh, Jake's brother, over in a small shack over there, Clint Carrington. And uh, we came again, we came in through the pines and uh, excellent roads out here. I was I was surprised how, how wide and how clean the roads are out here. They're doing a great job cleaning them up. So let's take a look at, inside the house and uh, see if our host, Amy Parrington is here. I know she is. Generator's going. She has it uh, nice and uh, toasty in there for us, I bet. There she is. Already got a little perch on. Yeah, first fish of the day. First fish of the day. Great. All right, why don't you step in there, Bruce? I'll close the door for a second. Keep the heat in. Hi, Amy. Hello. Oh my God, you got a yeah. movie on. We're, we're not wrapping up this morning. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. Hopefully we'll uh, we'll catch some of the ones that eat fish. <laughs> Is it really? Yeah. <laughs> Is it? Can you see it? I think so, right there. Like, can you see a tech? Taking her. It's like a crab. Yeah, they taste it. Yeah. Is it taking off with it? No, it's just sitting there. I, I don't think it can quite figure it out. I, that's the only thing I see over there. Not heavy. No. Mm -hmm. Oh, 
Oh. What? What? Oh, that was. What? That wasn't a crayfish. Something, something took that baby. Oh, shoot. Crap. Amy's got something on here. What do you think it is, Amy? Uh, probably an, another perch. And I lost it. And you lost it? Oh, my. <laughs> All right, Amy has something on. Something little. Something little? Yeah. Perch. Oh, yeah. Using a tungsten jig. Yeah. Well, nice. You're starting to catch something here. Gonna weed through and maybe get some big perch. Now, for just find their parents. <laughs> what kind of parent would let their child go out alone? <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. You're feisty. Kind of like we are because you're. Yeah, that's not bad. We're getting there. Amy's been getting, uh, catching all the perch. She's got the, <laughs> she's got the, the right lure. Cool. It's a keeper. Oh, it swallowed the hook. That's why. Hmm? Look at that hook. I have a hook all right on that bar. Right there. Right there. Woo! Right there. But the only person catching fish in the shack <laughs> is Amy. Sorry. Not sorry. <laughs> Not sorry. Unfortunately, missed probably a oh. couple really big northerns. Yeah, that one's, I think that one's well good. Again, <laughs> again, it's Amy catching a really nice perch. Very nice. Beautiful. I think that's going in the bucket. You want to switch poles? <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, uh, I'm not sure if the pole will help you or it's kill. Oh, that's, I think you're right. <laughs> well, folks, this is day two of our uh, fishing adventure. And uh, we're at yet another uh, different uh, fish house that the uh, Jake and Amy parent can own. <laughs> And uh, we're going to be doing a little bit different oh, fishing easy. here. Um, this is uh, Amy's personal shack. My she shack. <laughs> a nice setup, nice situation here. And uh, today our target fish is going to be crappie and uh, maybe some northern. Perch. And maybe some perch. And Amy uh, is uh, spoiling us by coming out, opening up the shack, getting the heater going. And then look what Amy caught right away when she uh, came here. So I was thinking maybe just leaving Amy here with Bruce. <laughs> and I'll go do some of her resort chores. <laughs> so, but uh, thank you very much, Amy. And uh um, I'm going to turn this off for a minute, come in and uh, find out some of the uh, infrastructure stuff of this thing. Cool. Is that it? Get it? Yep, you're on. You're on? Yep. Oh, yeah. I got one, Mike. All right. First one for us on the board. Broke, broke the, the, the lock. Oh. That looks good. We'll measure it, but I think it looks good. Hold on. I'll turn this off. We'll measure it. I'm not. Okay, Bruce just pulled this baby up. I don't know if I got any footage, footage of it coming out of the hole, but uh, just a beauty. Beautiful crappie. All right, I'll get a tool for you to get that hook out. Okay. Oh. Mike's got something. Well, I'm finally on the board. Had a boy, Mike. That's a nice baby. That is another nice one. Yeah. 
one yeah they're starting to come in it's starting to get a little fun now they're working and I want to I want to show this little jig that I'm going to have to remember to take off because it was in the house here <laughs> there we go nice catch tack Mike, you got something on? Yeah, I got one on. Oh yeah, you gotta, gotta bend in that. Okay, there she is. Yeah, yeah, baby. Another nicey. Got that one coming right out of the hole, buddy. Wow. Oh my God. That's a beauty. That is. Oh. Man, we're going to eat tonight. Yeah. Take it down a little bit. I figured something else on that one. It, it, brought, it brought it up a little bit. It wasn't as, on the bottom as much. I mean, I know on my graph where I need to go now, I'm up off the bottom a little bit. Yeah. And that's where they seem to be hitting it. Do you have something on? Yep, yep, got it. Okay. Good technique. Little t a little perch. Little perch. Yeah, the perch are coming in too, but that's what a baby. That's a baby perch. But they do get some good ones here, so we'll see how that goes too. So we might get the variety coming in. We'll see in a little bit. Hi folks, Mike from Minnesota again, and just uh, wanna say this is a wrap for today. It's dark out. We got uh, quite a few crappies. We just had a blast. Bruce and I had a blast on the ice the other day. Just a great time here and uh, um, great hosts, Jake and Amy Farrington in uh, preparing these houses that we fished in yesterday and today. I just can't thank them enough. And, uh, and if you get a chance, go take a look at their uh, resort on their website, uh, Cutfoot Sioux Resort. So until next time, folks, uh, this is Mike from Minnesota. Uh, make every day a great day. God bless.